What is up, fam? Welcome back to Leslie Jones Tarot. And this reading here is for my Scorpio Zodiac signs, y'all. It's late night. I just finished doing something for my daughter. She wanted a vanity, so I had to put it together. So why not try to do a reading before I fall asleep? Okay, so let's see what comes out. Let's just see what comes out. All right. Yeah, let's start off with this deck. I hope y'all can hear me. I'm a little quiet. Baby Snow is asleep. And um, I got the rain noises in the background and drying out my voice a little bit. But, all right, let's see. Confidence, it comes with time and practice. Okay, bottom of the deck, morning, the world awaits you. Okay, ooh, some of y'all about to get back outside. Some of y'all about to go back outside. If you hadn't, if you hadn't been out and about and stuff like that, maybe you've been kind of holding back from getting out. You about to go out there. Sound like a Scorpio summer, huh? <laughs> it says, it seems like everywhere around you, people are chattering about how confident they are and just how freeing it feels. You wish you could relate to them, but you haven't gotten there yet. Listen, it's all right. Confidence is not an instant or an overnight evolution. Just like with everything else, it takes time, practice, and a lot of unlearning of toxicity. So, now let's see. What does this have to do with Scorps? What you got going on? Let's see here. I've already done a pre-shuffle, but I'm going to shuffle it down on cam. All right, Scorpio. What you got going on? What my Scorpios got going on? All right, let's see. What's going on with Scorpios? What's this in a row? Bottom of the deck, page of pentacles in reverse. So we got the hangman. Hey you feel limited? About what? With the devil and the ten of pentacles. Some of y'all, is this money? Some of y'all be careful with your spending. Okay, but the hangman, you feel like you need to release something or you need to sacrifice something with the devil and the ten of pentacles. Or somebody do. Whether this is you or somebody you're dealing with, somebody need to see something from a different perspective. This could be you. Some of y'all could be a scare money don't make money. I just heard that. Scare money don't make money. Some of y'all, does this have to do with money? Finances? Yeah, because we got Page of Pentacles in reverse. Page of Pentacles in reverse is like bad news and business matters, earthly matters, money. Um, some of y'all feel unappreciated too. Or some of y'all feel unappreciated. This could be in the workplace or this could be in a family dynamic. Like some of y'all just feel unappreciated. Now I'm hearing that song. If you feel unappreciated. Some, 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 da, 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 da. Jojo? Was that one? Get out right now. It's the end of you and me. Is that it? I don't know. Maybe I'm mixing two songs up. I don't know. Somebody could have been cheating. Damn. Sorry. Or keeping secrets. Somebody being very secretive here. This could have... Some of y'all could be, you know, still suffering from... But you got the... Oh, you got the temperance angel. You're protected whatever's going on right now. Things are balancing out in your life for you. You're going to find some sort of peace. Some of y'all need to be patient when it comes to relationships, too. But you're going to find some sort of, like, inner calm. I don't know what this is. We're going to clarify it, though. Now, what's the hangman? Mm, I don't want that deck. I want this. What's this hangman? So, there's something where you could either be having, like, some sort of limiting beliefs... Or you feel trapped in a situation, like you don't feel like you're confident enough to get out of it. Or that has to do with money, business, inheritance, 
um, some sort of support. Some of y'all, some of y'all could be trying to leave like a toxic situation, and maybe you feel like you don't have the means to do it. But uh, spirit is saying you gonna be all right. You gonna be all right. Let's see, what's the hangman? Some of y'all may not know which direction you're going. What's the hangman? For Scorpio. Player and legal issues. Some of y'all feel... Okay, some of y'all got legal issues going on. And this could be with the player. Or this could be somebody that's been playing games. In some sort of situation. Some of y'all feel like the justice system playing games with you or somebody trying to play. For some of y'all, somebody could be trying to like take your inheritance or like take a property from you or some sort of stability. Watch your possessions. Make sure you dotting your I's and crossing your T's in any type of business situation right now. Bottom of the deck acting cold. You could have went cold on somebody or somebody's being cold or you're not talking to somebody. Some of y'all feel trapped in a connection or in some sort of legal binding contract or something with a player. This could be somebody that played just too many games like it ain't got to be like a cheater, but it could be like they play too much. Like maybe you're stuck or attached to somebody that like you focus on stability. You focus on saving. You focus on growing. But this person out here partying, living it up. And so they're, you know, there's cause and effect. So it hinders you. So you may not feel as confident enough to move away from this person or situation. Tell me more about the hangman. Or you feel trapped to them or binded to them in some sort of way. Or this is what somebody wants. Like this is somebody wanting you to feel like you stuck. But you really not. Uh, what's the hangman? An offer. So that they can give you an offer. Fake accounts. Be careful what you post on social media. Be careful what you post or say on social media. This person could be watching you from a fake account to see how they can come towards you or but this person they play games groupy energy this could be somebody you rejected before What's this hangman energy about for Scorpio? What's this hangman energy about? Some of y'all just could be an older masculine, mature man is here. A mature woman. It could be a couple. Bottom of the deck. It could be over a marriage. Some of y'all feel like y'all trapped in a marriage or you're dealing with a couple, a married couple. Or this, if it's not marriage, this could be somebody you're in business with. You could be in partnership with a couple or Y'all the couple, y'all in business. Y'all know y'all got to be mature about the situation, but somebody playing games? Or somebody want to play games? Imprisonment. Is somebody going to jail? Is somebody going to jail? Or somebody about to face some sort of time or something like that. It's like these two people could be like taking this legal situation serious. And then there's like another person that that's either about to go to jail or. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> it's going away. There could be this other person that's going to jail for this. Some of y'all, this could be like a sentencing. Like you're waiting for somebody to get sentenced or waiting for somebody to come back with you with an offer. Some of 
Somebody playing games. Message. You could be waiting on a message to come in or a letter or email or... What does that do with? What's the hangman about for Scorpio? I'm hearing a hung jury. I don't know. What's the hangman for Scorpio? What's the hangman? So yeah, this could be a divorce. We have moving. Change of res residence, moving in with your partner and divorce, experiencing a breakup. So some of y'all, this is a divorce. Yeah, they'll be back. Expect to hear from them soon. Maybe you're you're going through a divorce. You're waiting to hear back from the the other attorney. This could be two attorneys working together. Something's at play here when it comes to the justice system. You could be waiting to hear back. Caution. Find out more information. Don't overwork yourself. So yeah, it's like you sitting back just waiting for something to come in. But you, you're kind of stuck or you're kind of stagnant because it's, you're, in, you're in the in-between. Uh, what's the devil spirit? So you may not feel as confident about it or somebody don't feel as confident about it because it's kind of like in the in-between. What's the devil? Kissing ass. Child and drama starting. So, somebody toxic, dust it off, and child neglect, bad parenting, scared of, hates parents. Okay, so some of y'all are dealing with like a, a toxic connection. Okay, I'm just going to say it like that. One second. My bad, y'all. Had to wipe my nose. Lord, this cold is kicking my ass. Anyway, the devil... But I didn't start taking medicine, so I feel a lot better now. But the devil kissing ass and drama started. You got somebody that wants you to, like, bow down to them. Like, they want to make you feel like you powerless. Like, like you ain't worth shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, this could be somebody very materialistic. Or they want you to be codependent on them in some sort of way. This person is like a, the abuse of power type of thing. Like, they like control so they may do certain things so you'll come back and kiss their ass they may cause like a whole bunch of drama in your life unnecessarily for no reason for some of y'all yeah wolf and sheep's clothing this person could have betrayed y'all when it came to like look dirty offer uh -uh. it's like a ugh. i just had a a taste of vomit like in like the it's not like it didn't really happen but I just tasted vomit like somebody could drink alcohol <sighs> ugh. like ugh. ugh, that need to go away no somebody could drink alcohol I don't know that yeah, thank you, Spirit. I'm glad I said it because now it's gone. Good. Um, somebody is a wolf. Sorry, y'all. Somebody can't be trusted. Wolf in sheep's clothing, child neglect, and dusted off. But it, but the crazy thing is, it's like, you know that this person can't really be trusted. So you just kind of like, yeah, I know they a liar. I know they not doing this. Like, if this is somebody who has abandoned you before or left you out in the cold before, you kind of already know you're just not even... You're not even faced about it anymore. If this is like a baby daddy, baby mama that always neglects the kids, that don't even bother you no more. It's like, yeah, what's new? You know. What's new, pussycat? Whoa, 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 whoa. That's the energy. This person. Now, somebody's thinking about the other person. We got love on the brain, dreaming, fantasizing, daydreaming, nostalgic. Maybe you used to kiss this person's ass or like, Anytime they would stir drama up, drama up in your life or something like that. I don't see you doing that no more. This person, they might have. They, 
they may want to they may want to knock your confidence can i have one more on a devil card or they may like you in this toxic low vibrational energy but i just don't see you doing it you're not even paying attention you got your head outside looking at the window out the window you know you're going towards the light what's the devil with the kissing ass and drama starter for scorpio reflecting yeah i'm telling you somebody is either reflecting on how you used to love them or how you used to like be toxic for them or codependent on them in some sort of way jackpot or how they used to be codependent on you winning money got rich inheritance unexpected money somebody could be reflecting back on their toxicity i don't know if they did something where it caused a lot of drama because you wouldn't kiss their ass or something like that but that's what they're thinking about right now bad habits drug addictions toxicity and travel this person's toxic yeah this person's toxic that's my alarm clock for me to know i need to go to bed <laughs> it's 12 at night this person's toxic because i don't know what or like they got toxic ways about them Somebody's reflecting on that, looking over how this person was, what's the devil, or how you were at one point in time, maybe this is you reflecting, what's the devil, for Scorpio, high honor, you hold yourself in high regard now, change, yeah, you're looking for change, or you want to change in your life, you don't want toxicity, you don't want codependency, you don't want abuse, you don't want to deal with health issues, some of y'all, y'all don't even realize that you've been working on your confidence, like, because you're not accepting the toxic things that you used to accept anymore. That's building up your confidence right there. Being able to say no to things that don't feel right for you. I see you saying no to toxicity as much as you can. Some of y'all could be a child or a child could be significant. Or some of y'all could be purchasing a new car pathway, yeah. You could be choosing to go in a new direction because you just don't want to be toxic anymore. You kind of, you want to go with your higher self. Also, others of you, your ancestors are like trying to guide you away from a toxic situation. And the way they're doing that is like kind of trying to like isolate you and make you work and love on yourself. So you'll not want to go back to that like when you reflect on it you'll think back like oh my god that was so toxic like ugh. like you become disgusted with it but anyways ten of pentacles no 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 let me go back what's the devil about for scorpio clarify the devil intimacy sexual chemistry reminiscing and then distance some of y'all are at a distance from this person you and your partner may be physically or emotionally distant. This person could be thinking about you sexually. They want you to open up your heart. It will help you attract more love. Instead of like sexual based connections. Or you could have somebody coming towards you. But spirit is saying that they're coming to be intimate with you. But the reminiscing is here. So maybe you've known this person already. But. It could have been toxic last time. I don't know. Give me one more with the devil card. Can I have one more on this devil energy? Let go. Make room for the new beginning on its way to you now. I mean, I got somebody like at a distance from you that want to come towards you, but they just want to be intimate. Communicate. Compromise, forgive, work it out, and then health. Health issues could arise. Ooh. Spirit is saying, let go. Make room for the new beginning on its way to you now. So as you carry yourself in high regard, like you won't be dealing with type of stuff like this anymore. Because you, you're not saying that you're better than anybody, but you just kind of, you worked on, you built your confidence back up. And you're just like, yeah, yeah, I'm not settling for that competition fighting just a sexual connection no strings attached i'm good i don't want that 
Some of y'all can be really focused on your money, your finances, your stability with the Ten of Pentacles coming out. Now, others of you, if this is like a court case or something like that, y'all could be winning like a, a home or some sort of inheritance. I have boss, daddy, stable, rich, business owner, CEO, big, deep energy, and moving on. Thank you, next. Some of y'all are moving on from this boss, daddy energy. Y'all could be getting a payout. They lost their chance, or you did. This is someone with a, there was some sort of missed opportunity, whether it was on your end or their end, or both. What's the Ten of Pentacles? Queen Rising, but you, I mean, she, you ain't no spring chick. You seem to be doing your own thing, too. Stepping into power, praise, coming up spotlight. Some of y'all, y'all, I just, I heard behind the mask. Behind the mask, cyberbully. You are being bullied online, or they are has suffered from it. So some of y'all say this person say you were actually a really good employee, or you were doing your own thing when it came to like business matters, money, finances. This person could have put themselves out there and made it look like it was them. And now that this person is moving on, or you're moving on from the company, like it ain't gonna be the same. Or they're moving on, so now you can step into the, your power and like actually claim rights to what's yours. Give me one more on this Ten of Pentacles. Broke butt. Running. Ain't shit. Somebody could be running away from this. Caught a case. Cloud hungry. Somebody feels like somebody not caught a case or somebody does stuff for cloud. Somebody feels like you're broke. Love triangle. Oh my god, this just went left. Like somebody could be in a love triangle watching you. Why did I say watching you? Did I say watching you? Oh my gosh. Okay, well maybe they're watching you. Yeah, because cloud hungry. Thank you, Spirit. I'm sorry. Caught a case, cloud hungry, love triangle. For some of y'all, somebody. Somebody could have did something for Cloud, or they feel like you you do stuff for Cloud, or because of this third party, or they do this for Cloud because of this third party creeping and happiness. Do they feel like you're hating on their happiness, or you feel like they're hating on your happiness? That's why they want you to be broke, or they don't want you to get this. Somebody doesn't want you to get something, or feel confident enough to feel like you deserve it. Or it's over. What's Ten of Pentacles for Scorpio? Wealthy man is here. Some of y'all could be dealing with a wealthy man courtship. Maybe this is somebody you dated. What's this Ten of Pentacles for Scorpio? Distance, distant horizon. Bottom of the deck, great fortune. So yeah, you're about to be in some sort of great fortune energy. Family room and in prison. Somebody going to jail. What's Ten of Pentacles for Scorpio? I don't even know if I'm going to upload this or not. I'm so sleepy. I don't know what I'm saying. Gold digger. Somebody feel like you're a gold digger. Or somebody feels like somebody's a gold digger, a narcissist. Someone is too full of themselves. Somebody thinks that somebody's a gold digger, but why do I feel like mm -mm. I knew it. Hold on now. There could be this sound right. There could be somebody trying to make it out like you a gold digger or like you broke and that's why you need them or that's why they moving on from you. Because you broke and you ain't got no money and whoop de whoop whoop, right? So somebody could have tried to play you like you was a gold digger when really you had narcissists and then before that is gambling. It says problems with addiction or gambling bad finances. Are you really a gold digger or is this person a gold digger? 
Did they already just not have shit before they even came in your face? Or did they already not have shit before they even talked to you? Like this. Yeah, caution. Find out more information. Don't overwork yourself. Some of y'all been dealing with a narcissist and they gonna try to play you like you a gold digger. When when they were the one with the bad finances or bad gambling addictions or something. But they're trying to play you off like you're the one that health issues could arise and love spells. So, bitch. Bitch. Somebody trying to play you. Somebody trying to scapegoat you. Or scapegoat somebody like, nah, man. I had to leave that person because they were taking money from me, but in reality, this person never had no money. Oh my God. Okay. I'm about to get out there. Either I'm super sleepy or like I'm super tapped the fuck in. I don't know. Because <laughs> I am exhausted. Last night I didn't get no sleep. But I'm going to redo this reading in the morning. I don't know if I'm going to upload this or not. Because I don't know if I you know, fell asleep or not. I'm tired, y'all. I worked on that vanity for like three. It's supposed to take two hours to get it together. Child. My little slow ass. Uh, it took about three. <laughs> so I'm tired. And I, I had only got like three hours of sleep last night. So anyway. Let's see. Messages for Scorpio. Messages for Scorpio. Let's see. A few more messages for Scorpio. Is somebody really trying to make you out like you a gold digger or something? Because that's what I'm getting. Somebody trying to make somebody like that a gold digger. And they're not a gold digger. Somebody just don't know how to handle their finances. <laughs> I'm snitching on somebody. But they could have made you feel like you wasn't good enough. Because confidence, it comes with time and practice. Somebody could have made you feel like, or maybe this person is battling with confidence issues. Self-esteem issues. So what they did was they kind of kicked you to put you down to make themselves feel confident. It's easy to, to shift blame instead of take accountability. Or... Alright. Kids or pets. Some of y'all can have kids or pets. Motorcycle. Orange, black, white, butterfly. Customer service rep. Dimples. Sandals or flip-flops. Look, money coming in. Their magic is backfire. Backfiring karma is playing out. White socks, truck or jeep, sweaty feet and or hands. <laughs> a hating ass water sign. Some, some of y'all could be dealing with another water sign. Or they could have said you were a hater. Shout out. Car and SUV, blonde or brown hair, bubbles. We have throwing rocks and hiding their hands. See? New comfort or sheet set cheerleader or gymnastics, mor mortgage or rent payments, and sending you the evil eye. I'm going to leave there. Squirt. I ain't even got nothing else to say. This is what I have for you. Hope it brings you clarity and insight. Appreciate y'all so much for watching. Catch y'all in the next video. Bye, y'all.